Hello everybody, this is Jim Cashel of Forum One. I'd like to speak today about good ideas, and specifically, where do good ideas go to live online? What is the best way to manage good ideas? Let me start with a brief description of what I mean. On May 15th and 16th, the Harvard Kennedy School is holding a two-day celebration of big ideas in public policy. Over 50 presentations will be given by former heads of state, famous academics, and others. After the event, what will happen to all of the content? The best videos will be put on YouTube. The best PowerPoints will be put on SlideShare. Photos will go to Flickr. Documents to Scribd. But what happens to the good ideas themselves? Where do best ideas end up? In blogs, research documents, tweets? There currently is no web archive which aggregates, tags, ranks, discusses, and distributes good ideas. A sort of YouTube for good ideas, if you will. Mind you, there's lots of other ideas events like that at the Kennedy School. Here are a few. There are over a thousand TEDx events alone. And what about other ideas competitions and organizations that broker in ideas? What if good ideas from all of these sources could be cataloged in one place? What all of these initiatives would benefit from would be a good ideas platform. We've actually built a beta site for this called Good Ideas, which is at goodideas.org. The core hypothesis is that we can get a lot smarter as a planet, directing our efforts towards the most effective ideas to address issues that matter. What are some of the characteristics of this initiative? Good Ideas is an open, non-commercial, highly participatory initiative, similar in spirit to Wikipedia. One important characteristic of good ideas is that it will define the format of ideas, much like Twitter defines and constrains a comment to 140 characters, or Ignite defines and constrains a presentation to five minutes. Good ideas will define and constrain a good idea to about two sentences plus a URL, that is 200 characters, basically an expanded tweet. For example, here is one idea. Did you know that there was a 60% reduction in accidents in Kenyan microbuses when they put signs on the driver's seat that read, if I'm driving too fast, please let me know? Wow, what an idea. And this idea will have its own page with comments, tags, ranking, and related resources. So what does success look like? Imagine a highly organized archive of 100,000 current good ideas addressing issues of global importance. Would we be able to extract value from such an archive? Imagine if every ideas organization maintained their own good ideas channel, much like they maintain a YouTube or slide channel to slide share channel today. Imagine if the good ideas site was routinely referenced by those working on policy issues of importance. Imagine a world in which we're just a little bit smarter in how we address issues of importance. Good Ideas is actually the first part of a larger multi-year initiative, the Global Solutions Project. We envision that Good Ideas would be the repository for the raw material of policymaking, the good ideas. We then envision having work groups taking best clusters of good ideas to craft solutions on solutions.org. At that point, best solutions would be crafted into policy recommendations by experts on policy.org. All of this attempts to address policy issues in a global participatory way, supplementing traditional mechanisms of governance. If you are interested, there are plenty of ways to participate. Just visit goodideas.org explore, comment, vote, and of course, post ideas of your own. This idea will require some passionate participants. It won't need tons, even Wikipedia has a pretty small number of core contributors, but it will take partners who see the value and the potential for goodideas.org. Please contact me if you like and help spread the word. Thanks so much.